Mark, T minus five minutes and counting. T minus five. At this point, the Apollo access arm should be coming back, and it is now moving back at the 320 foot level to its fully retracted position high atop the tower at pad A. Our countdown still proceeding at this time at the four minute mark in the countdown. The overall count will be turned over to the launch vehicle test conductor. Ray Roberts, the launch vehicle test conductor, will conduct the final four minutes as all uh, different aspects uh, move over to the launch vehicle test conductor's channel. The uh, Automatic sequence, as reported, will come in at the three minute and six second mark in the countdown. We're standing by at four minutes, 16 seconds and counting. This is launch control. As we were telling you at, at one minute and 17 seconds into the flight, that's when you see the great contrail begin as, uh, the, as the spacecraft uh, begins to emerge from the deep atmosphere of Earth. And it's called an area of maximum dynamic pressure, too, uh, when the maximum buffeting takes place and uh, when the stresses and strains on this big 363 feet of vehicle uh, are the most intense. Uh, at that point, uh, the big engines, uh, the five engines of the, uh, of the first stage are gulping 3,000 gallons of fuel a second. Here's Jack King again. minutes and 30 seconds and counting. We have completed our communications checks with the Apollo 8 astronauts in the cabin, and the communications are go. Coming up shortly will uh, be in the automatic sequence, where we have a completely automatic uh, checkout of the launch vehicle from uh, three minutes and six seconds down. We have firing command. The firing command is in. We are now on the automatic sequence, T minus three minutes and counting. During this period, once we do get the firing command, the various tanks within the three stages of the Saturn V launch vehicle begin to pressurize. They all must be under pressure before we're ready to launch. We have a sequence status board here in the control room that will give us readouts on the overall status of the space vehicle as we reach the terminal phases in the countdown. Now, two, two minutes, 32 seconds and counting. Our status board indicates that all aspects are ready, instrument unit is ready, spacecraft ready, final check of the emergency detection system, that ready light also on. First stage preparations are completed. Two minutes, 15 seconds and counting, the tanks continuing to pressurize in the vehicle. Not as many reports coming now as we all stand by on the launch vehicle test conductor's channel. Coming up on the two-minute mark on the Apollo 8 mission. Two minutes and counting. T-minus two minutes and counting. We are still proceeding. We now have uh, recorded that the uh, first stage uh, liquid oxygen tank has been pressurized and the pressure is still building up. One minute, 45 seconds and counting. We have a vehicle weighing 6.2 million pounds on the pad. Interestingly enough, some 1,200 pounds of that weight is just frost on the side of the vehicle created by the extremely low temperatures of the propellants. Coming up on 90 seconds, mark T minus 90 seconds and counting. The Apollo 8 uh, crew standing by, spacecraft commander Frank Borman, Jim Lovell, Bill Anders. We now have a report that the liquid hydrogen tank on the third stage is pressurized. One minute, 15 seconds. All third stage uh, propellants pressurized at this time as we come up on the 60 second mark on a flight to the moon. T minus 60 seconds and counting. T minus 60 seconds and counting. The vehicle now is completely pressurized. We're coming up on a power transfer shortly. T minus 50 seconds and counting. We have the power transfer. We're now on the flight batteries within the launch vehicle. 45 seconds. Final reports coming from Frank Borman at this time. Final uh, look at the switch list aboard the spacecraft. 35 seconds and counting. We'll lead up to an ignition sequence start at 8.9 seconds. This will lead up as we build up the thrust to a liftoff. If all goes well, at zero. We've just passed the 25 second mark in the count. 20 seconds, all aspects, we are still go at this time. T minus 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9. We have ignition sequence start. The engines are on. Four, three, two, one, zero. We have commit. We have we have lift off. Lift off at 7:51 a.m. Eastern Standard Time.
Good, three, go. Roger, right, five down. How are you, Booster? Play down, Frank. Good. 
Roger. And we have uh, Seco. Sure. Roger, Seco. Go. CMC is go. Roger. Stand by for you, Fido. Roger, flight. 